So hello everyone. So today I'm gonna show you how you can connect a PlayStation 4 controller into a PC. So you can connect it with a wire, or so what you need a PlayStation 4 controller and a little pen. And of course you need a computer the one I'm using is Windows 10 so first what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and click right here then right click here and go to settings once you're here once you're in settings over here Or the other way you can do it around you can just go ahead and click right here you go ahead and type in Bluetooth here and you can click right here that's another way to do it so you're gonna go ahead and click right here once you're over here so now you're gonna go to your controller you're gonna hit the home button the light will flash just like that you're going to use the pen to reset your PlayStation 4 controller. You're going to go ahead and reset it for 5 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So now you don't need this anymore. Let's put it on the side. So now you have your controllers resetted. So what you're going to do is you're going to hold the share. You're going to hold the share button. And you're gonna hold the home so at the same time. So this is what's gonna happen once you hold once you hold these two, this is what's gonna happen. The light's gonna flash double. See that the light is flashing double. That's how the light shows flash. That means now your controller is ready to pair to your computer. So once you go here, what you're gonna do is you're gonna click Bluetooth. So once you click here, your device should be showing up as a wireless controller. You're going to click on that and your controller should connect. Now you can you can play any game you want on this controller. So once your controller is spared, just click done. You can use your controller as playing any game so let's go ahead and try the Tomb Raider so over here I have a Tomb Raider game so I, I, as you guys can see I can I can use the controller, it works fine. So, you saw the controller works fine. You can use it as any game, the controller will work. So you can use it as any game, the controller still will work. So, on the Tomb Raider 4 is the old one. Tomb Raider 4 is the old Tomb Raider. I cannot use my controller to play the Tomb Raider 4. So I can't use it. So what I need to what I need to get is I need to go to this website. It's gonna be in the description below. You're gonna go ahead and you're gonna download this program over here, the winner. So you're gonna go ahead and click your computer. So you're gonna click English 64 computer. So you're gonna go ahead and drag this to your desktop. Once you have that done, you're gonna end up clicking on it and go ahead and install it. Once you're done, just exit this out. So you're gonna go to this website right there 
This website is going to be in the description below. Again, you're going to click download. Scroll down. You're going to hit DS4. So once you download it over here for your Windows, you're going to drag it to the desktop again. So now what you need to do is now right click on it, extract to DS4 to Windows. You're going to have the file over here. So I have the file right here. You're gonna click on it. You're gonna right click again and you're gonna go to send to desktop. And you go send it to desktop, exit this out, and make sure to keep your file, make sure to keep this file somewhere. So once you get there over there, once you have it on the desktop, shortcut it to the desktop, you're gonna go ahead and bring it and drop it right here. So once you drop it over here, you're going to go ahead and click on it. Once you click on it, your controller should automatically show up over here. It tells you how much life battery it has. And you actually can change the color on it. You can go ahead and change it as red. Customize it as red any color you want so I'm gonna go ahead and use yellow so I'm using as the yellow color over here so now what you need to do is so default default is where you can actually just go ahead and click default and you can open any game you can still play the controller but I have this game over here Tomb Raider 4, I cannot use the controller to play it. So you open, so you're gonna go to the game settings. I'm gonna go ahead and control. So, I have my controller here, but this game, Tomb Raider 4, doesn't work on the controller, so I need it to work. So, what we can do, you know, just leave it as the default as it is. I'm gonna go ahead and create one. I'm gonna go ahead and put this as Q, this as W, E, R. So next, you're just gonna go ahead and name it. What kind? Of, what game is this? So it's a uh, name of Tom 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 Rider, right? Tom Rider. So you're gonna hit save. Once you hit save, you're gonna go ahead and click here and use it as Tom Rider. So I have the keyboard over here, where I went to settings and pull up the keyboard. So, so what I need to do is. I need to go ahead and use my keyboard. Use my keyboard and click on the control that I want to change and just use the controller to change it. You're gonna go ahead and click this and then you're gonna change it. You're gonna go ahead and click this and then you're gonna go ahead and click this. So once you click that, your controller moves, but you still you cannot click these, you cannot press any of the buttons, so you have to change keyboard with it so you're gonna use the keyboard to change each key movement that you have here so we're gonna say Doug I want it to be right here or up like that okay Doug is up and then you can go dash I'll make it this one walk I'll make it this one and uh, jump I'll make it as Square um, action, I'll make it this X withdraw, I'll make it this and flame, I'll just use it as O look, I'll make it triangle roll, I'll just go ahead and do this as roll and escape, I'll just use this as escape step forward I'll just make it that and then 
that I'm just gonna get that. So right now you should exit the game out. There you go. Well look, jump works. With draw gun, I don't have any gun right now. But there you go. Jump. Twix. There you go. So that's how you use this controller on a computer to play any game. Comment below what questions you have for the controller. And please like my video and subscribe if you guys want to see more amazing videos. Thank you.